You have a pretty Appreciate special that. young quarterback there in Carolina with Kyle Allen. What makes him so special? You know, from the day he got here uh, last year, undrafted uh, free agent, we signed him out of Houston. Um, there was something about him, you know, whether he was running the scout team or in training camp, whether he was running with the threes and the fours, he just always had this, this confidence to him that you never understood, you know, really why. I mean, he's running with the fourth team. But as time went on, you started to realize it's just his demeanor. He has an unbelievable amount of confidence. The moment never seemed too big. No more relevant than when he went last year, week 17 on the road, got his first career start down. Um, against New Orleans and came out, you know, scored 30 points, had a great game. I think that was the point where all of us around the organization said, this, this young kid's got something special. And it all starts with his confidence, his demeanor. Um, nothing's too big. He, he's, he's a special young kid. And for him to be 5-0 and in his five starts, 4-0 and this year after taking over for Cam is, is pretty remarkable. And, you know, Greg, Michael Strahan here. Terry was so enamored with you not being on that list that he doesn't know who the other five are that were on that <laughs> list. He's forgotten I always about knew that, Terry, man. I always knew Terry was my guy. I knew that last year when I came. Me and Terry hit it off. That's right. Oh, Terry hits it off with everybody, man. But, you know, you want to be a network analyst. Obviously, you're there calling the game for us. You're back this year you're with us last year as well. Here's a question that everyone is asking. When Cam Newton is healthy... Should the Panthers stay with Allen? You guys are undefeated with him. Or should you go back to Cam? You guys were 0-2 with him. You guys are really putting me on the spot here before my, <laughs> my big call in this game. You're making me nervous. But, uh, you know, listen, here's the reality. We all know the, the elephant in the room, and that's the dynamic with Cam coming back off, you know, off being injured for the last few weeks. Kyle, obviously, is 4-0, has kind of rallied us to this point going into the bye. The reality is everyone in our organization, myself included, I'd be at the top of the list, understand what Cam has meant and still continues to mean to this organization, to this team. Um, he's elevated a lot of guys' careers, including my own. And then at the same time, we have a young quarterback who's just done an unbelievable job stepping in in a difficult situation, limited experience, and has won four in a row. So we take it as a good situation. Until Cam is back on his feet, running around in the, in the Cam that we're used to, we're going to keep rolling with Kyle, but I know once Cam is back and he has his legs under him, you know, he's still that MVP caliber guy that we've seen over the years, and it's just a matter of getting healthy. And, and when he's back, we have a hard decision to make. But until then, uh, we're going to keep rolling with what, what's working and, uh, and just wish Cam a, a speedy recovery. We want to get him back as soon as we can. All right, after being off Gronk's list and Michael's question, calling the game will be easy for you. Have a good time there. <laughs> Greg Olson. All right, thanks, hey, guys. Jake Laser. What is the story with Cam Newton? Look, you know, I looked at Cam Newton's contract last night, and you can glean a lot out of that. He has about $10 million left in this year's deal. But listen, if Allen continues to play well, Cam Newton next year, if they release or trade him, they will save $19.1 million in salary cap room. And remember, this is the last year of Cam Newton's deal. So they have to either decide, let's move on from him and save that $19 million or sign him to a long-term contract extension. I think if Kyle Allen continues to play this well, again, I think the answer lies in Cam Newton's numbers.